I'm so grateful that everybody came out to be with me. Um, about two years ago, right after I had my son, excuse me, I would be me, phone ringing. <laughs> about two years ago after I had my son, I started suffering with postpartum depression. Nobody really knew but my husband, my parents. Um, and I went on a, a search and a journey for purpose because I feel like we all are placed here on this earth for a reason. And when I first met my husband, we had a conversation and I asked him, I said, baby, what's your deepest fear? And he said, living this not life and never finding my purpose, never meeting my purpose. My biggest fear is death. Mm -hmm. So I didn't quite understand what he meant. But as time has gone on, I understand exactly what he meant. And I stand here today so grateful and so thankful that I have found my purpose. I went on that search, like I said, like two years ago after my struggle. And at the age of 15, my brother was murdered. And then I struggled from depression. Not too many people know because I struggled silently. Again, my parents knew. My best friend that I recently just strongly rekindled with, she knew. But I really struggled in silence. And when my brother was murdered, his murder was never found. So I thought, well, I wanna be a criminal investigator, right? I wanna give families closure because we never got that closure. But God had a different plan for my life. And he said, no, you won't necessarily give families closure through investigation, but you'll give families closure through grief counseling. You'll give families closure through evidence-based interventions. You'll help change and shape the lives of children. And as I stand here today, I've been so many places. I've seen so many things. I've seen autopsies, y'all. I've held a human heart in my hand, literally have seen so many things, seen so many places. I can think of so many kids and so many families right now who have really helped shape me into the person that I am today. That's my reason. That's why I'm standing here. And I'm just so grateful that all of y'all came out to celebrate this time with me on my journey and my quest for purpose. And this is my purpose now, but I believe purpose evolves. It changes over time. So, I'll continue to try to evolve, change, and grow. And that's where True Colors Tangible Change Behavioral Health Services comes in. So again, I thank y'all. I love each and every one of you, my beautiful you. cousins. <laughs> I thank y'all for being here, my friends, my sisters, godmothers, everybody. On behalf of Kemper Pond Office Park, I'm very pleased to welcome our very newest tenant. Thank you. Kanaya Murray. Thank it's going to be a pleasure, and I suspect we're going to be working together for a long, long time. Absolutely. Right. Thank you, Julie. Best of luck to you. Thank you for everything. Julie has been yeah. great throughout this entire time. Yeah. Now I'd like to introduce my father, who's also the mayor of City of Springdale, who's like to okay, nice. cut the ribbon. Good. Okay. Thank you very much. You know, Kanaya, you've got a... You got a story, a trifecta here today. <laughs> Your landlord is here. <laughs> she's also the, the president of the Chamber of Commerce, uh -huh. and she's also the mayor's daughter. So yes. how's that? Right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Welcome to all of you. Um, it, it's a real pleasure. Thank you, pleasure. To welcome Kanaya and, and her business into Springdale. You know, it, it's a pleasure to, to to I've cut a mini ribbons over the years. This is my twenty going on my twenty eighth year as mayor. I've cut hundreds of ribbons, but the ones that really stand out are the ones that open a business that, that sole purpose is to improve the quality of life. Mm. And I think that if, if any of you have any doubts, I think just listening to this young lady's dissertation here would convince you that she's the type of person that's going to change a lot of lives in a very positive way. Mm -hmm. so I, right. All I can say is that, that we wish you... Um, uh, much success, and um, Lord only knows how how bad we need um, businesses like this. Right. Behavioral changes in today's environment are, are, are so good and so are so needed. So good luck, and uh, may the good Lord 
let's look over you, not only your business, but also you and, and your wonderful family. All right, so congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. All right, then I'd like, on behalf of the city, I'd like to uh, present you uh, a history book, The City nice, of Springdale. Nice, okay. Yeah. We're very proud of this. And uh, I scribble a little an inscription here. Congratulations to True Colors Tangible Behavioral Health Service on the opening of your new business here in Springdale. We wish you the very best and much success. Mayor Webster, December 4, 2022. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, that's right there, yeah. Are you ready to open business? I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready. See, ain't I'm ready. Can you get a picture? Here, I'm going to turn this way for you, Mayor Webb. There we go. Good stuff. You ready? Can I cut yeah, with you? Put your hands on there for okay. me. Okay, let's count down from three. Two, put ready? Put your hand on it. <laughs> two. Three. Two. One. One. Open it. Yeah. Yeah. All righty. Congratulations, baby. Thank you. Yeah. Thank y'all for being here. Ah. I want to give a special thanks to my husband. This man pushes me on a daily basis out of my comfort zone to be the best version of myself. When I tell y'all this wouldn't be a thing without this man right here. Right. Amen. Telling me to jump out the window, baby. Right. You got it. You <laughs> right. be like, right. do it. Right. 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 To my parents for always, always being right there with me, supporting me in every endeavor. Without them, there's no me. And to my amazing son, just is <laughs> amazing in every way that you could ever imagine. So thank y'all. Thank you, everybody. Yay. Right. Yay. Yeah. All right. Welcome in. Hello, my name is Kanaya C. Murray, and I am the founder and CEO of True Colors Tangible Change Behavioral Health Services. This is my husband, Andre Murray Jr., and we are here today to tell you a little bit about True Colors Tangible Change. Our mission is to help kids who suffer from trauma or PTSD or anxiety and give them their different mechanisms or coping mechanisms to help them better themselves in, in life. So I, I guess our whole purpose and mission is to show kids that it's, it's, it's in positive ways that there's ways to overcome things even if it's even if it's as bad as losing someone close to them or even if it's something like their parents got divorced and they're going through some things and start acting out we're here to help so we provide three different types of services we are a community-based um, program, so we go out into the community, we go out into the homes of our clients, out into the schools of our clients, and we have the saying that we like to meet clients where they are, both figuratively and literally. Mm -hmm. So we're literally out in the community um, meeting them where they are. We service youth and young adults ages 7 to 21 years old. Um, and we believe that we should stay true to ourselves. However, we should impact change. That change is inevitable. Mm. Growth is what we all need um, to be the best versions of ourselves. Absolutely. And that's just what we're doing here at True Colors, Tangible Change. To come see us. <laughs> yeah, we are located at 1325 um, East Kemper Road. Suite 211, that's Springdale, Ohio, 45246. If you want to send a referral, if you are an educator, um, if you work in the court system, and you have any clients who you feel like may benefit from community-based services, um, we are currently accepting referrals for clients. You can go onto our website at www.true tc2.org and go under our services tab um, find that referral even if you're a parent and you feel like your child might be in need of services we also accept self-referrals so find that referral fill it out um, send it over to admin at true tc2.org we will look through your referral and we will contact you um, and help you set up services as soon as possible please like us follow us on Facebook at True Colors Tangible Change Behavioral Health Services, 
Follow us on Instagram at true underscore tc2.org and just entrust us that we are here to impact the community. We have a saying, stand true, impacting change.